On February 8th, your Akron Ziz basketball squad matched up against the Eastern Michigan Eagles. At the start of the game, Channel Banks deflected a pass in the passing lane, getting down the court to finish a fast break layup that put the first points on the board. Not soon after, Eastern Michigan put their first points on the board while passing down low for a tough lay-in. Eastern Michigan started to get hot early in the first half, finding many gaps in Akron's defense. They were able to find easy points and get the ball down low to score. The Eagles ended up going on a 12-0 run against Akron. Akron was struggling to find their offense and committed turnovers. That gave Eastern Michigan a chance for an and one play. Being down 11 left Akron needing a boost in their offense, which they found in a ferocious dunk by Cameron Reese to gain their momentum. Akron started to fix their weaknesses in their offense and found great ways to score. A nice looking lob from Tyler Cheese to Cameron Reese put them only down two. Cameron Reese was putting on an absolute show down low as he was able to throw down the and one to end the first half. The second half started off right with Tyler Cheese hitting a three ball to tie up the game. Not only did he hit one, but fired another three in the corner to put the zips back up. Although Akron found their offense, the Eagles did not back down as they came in aggressive to score. It was a constant back and forth battle as both teams fought to take the lead. Using a nice pump fake, Williams put Akron up two as he performed a tough hop step layup. The following play, they didn't react through a behind post hook to score the basket. Eastern Michigan worked their way through Akron's defense to find another bucket. They stuck to the inside game as they figured out that was their strong point. They were able to find many field goals that way. The Zips were going for all the marbles as Lauren Jackson jacked up a deep three-point shot that went in and put the Zips up two. Coming towards the end of the second half, Akron found themselves down six with less than a minute to go. A difficult moving shot from Tyler Cheese left them within three. Eastern Michigan was up two, but Akron went hard to go home as a clutch three-point shot from Williams went in and gave the Zips the one-point lead. Less than five seconds to go, the Eagles rushed down court to throw up a possible game-winning floater that got taken out the air by Channel Banks to win the game. What an amazing way to end the game by your Akron Zips. You're watching DTV Sports Report. Desmond Mitchell signing off. Thanks for watching.